Welcome to episode 18, and finally we are here at the moment, and we will breach this cavern. So I've set up a, uh, another squad of archers, and, uh, well, I don't think I've really done much else. You can see I'm, I'm just slowly clearing up the mess that uh, there was in it is and around here. Um, God, my corpse piles are getting big, aren't they, up there, so I may need to find another... Maybe dig a whole new level for just for corpses. That's that's entirely possible. In fact, that's not a bad idea, is it? Um, well, 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 we won't we won't tie up the miners just now, anyway. Uh, so let's go in. So let's remove that area there and uh, see what we see, as it were. So they're gonna have to. They've always got to come down here through all the stone traps past my barracks. Someone's just claiming a uh, dwarf. I think a baby just got killed. What the hell? Look, it's my, it's my baron. It's my baron that's actually done it. My baron came down. I should perhaps probably take him off mining now. <laughs> I think I think I may just do that right now. So my baron acid comes and breaks. It's got, it's got like an honorary tradition. Oh, I'm going to break the seal. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's let's remove him from that. And a really loud jingle. Um, so what that really loud jingle meant was basically saying uh, we've discovered various things, crystal blade, microline, etc. Uh, yeah, I mean all all these different things. It's basically all these different gems we've we've now discovered, and everybody's going to come try and collect them. I think. Um, so we kind of need to sort things out. Okay, the dogs are going to. Oh, I was hoping the dogs were going to go and investigate. Not sure why they're following that guy. Maybe there is pets or something. So looks like we've we've actually managed to breach it right in the corner, which is quite handy. I don't think it goes up anywhere else, does it? it? Doesn't no, it doesn't go up there. So we've managed to catch it right into the corner. So that's working out quite well for us. So should we just go investigate with our army? Um, should we go for a little walk, or should we let the hunters do it for us? Because the hunters will kind of uh stray war dog was struck down. What the hell? Huh? Yeah. Oh no. Oh no 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 no. Oh no 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 no! Don't tell me that some dwarf's gone on a rampage. Did I miss something? That tells that that's got the the markings of a dwarf going on a mission there, hasn't it? I did was just about to say a baby got lost. Is that a forgotten beast? Where the hell's he come from? What the? What the fuck? <laughs> Hold on a minute. I'm unsure how that's. Where did he just come from? There. No. I don't know where he just came from. However, I do know that there is a dwarf on him, and it is my commander. Oh, he's going to combat training. Well, that's nice. How the fuck did he get in? Well, we can we can safely say get the fucking squads in action. Kill that. I think he just killed the dog, but um, we'll pull the boys down from the top as well. We need to get on this. So somehow I forgot. Really? I mean, how? Anyone honestly say you saw a P come past this this entrance? Nothing at all came past here, did it? He just... He can't have come in through there, can he? Please answers on a postcard. How the fuck this forgotten beast just managed to randomly appear in my stairwell? 
Well, we're on it. A baby's been born. Oh, that's nice. Do you mind actually going back to the battle? There's, there's a forgotten beast to be had here. I assume we're on it from every angle now. Yeah, we're above it. We're, we've got it surrounded, so I think we should kill it. This item is amazing. I shall name it. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> Something tells me that they just killed it. So he's just named his uh, silver war hammer. Um, yes, he got the kill. There we go. One kill. Bang! It's the beast, the forgotten beast. So he's named it after that forgotten beast kill. So. Well, I wasn't quite expecting that. I thought, for a minute, I thought one of my dwarves had gone on a bit of a tantrum or something. So, did we lose any dwarves in that uh, random battle? No. I think we lost some dwarves, maybe. Uh, Loopy is actually, Loopy Juice is very unhappy. Uh, one of my one of my guys. Uh, I'm not sure what that is. I could do with looking at seeing why he's so unhappy, but... Uh, Let's cancel their orders again. And they can go about their business. So what did we lose in there? Other than the dog. And a war dog. So these guys are back in there. That's why they're unhappy because they're in the burrow. That's why they're generally unhappy, I think. Miserable buggers. It's almost like there was a baby da died in there or something. It's somewhat what I mean. You, this is the problem with the females. You take a, you take, a <laughs> they'll have a baby and uh, take him into combat. Oh well, we don't need to worry about that forgotten beast, do we? <laughs> uh, how how did that get there? Because there's doors here. There's dogs there with, on the leash to spot it. So he, he must have. He must have come in through there. That's the only explanation I have. It's got to be. He, but he would have come in a lot earlier. I don't. I don't know. I'm at an actual loss for that one. No. Honestly, could not tell you how he got in there. Well, at least it's not an explosion of cats. It's, uh, the baby moon born. Really, what? What the f fuck was that all about? Hmm. I am confused. It has to be said. Uh, you probably don't want to be seeing this, do you? Really. I, I try not to show... I mean, please feel free to leave comments. If you wanted to see me really actually just sit and play in the game permanently, um, I kind of wanted to try and keep things a little bit more entertaining than uh, watching me basically do what you guys do at home and just sit and placing. This is not exactly the most exciting part of Dwarf Fortress. I'm going to go around and play... Oh, I don't know, actually, saying that, some OCD people would probably love it. Uh, a few of my friends have just started... For example, are some of those. So, I do have that sterling silver chest in there where I'm trying not to place. Won't be the end of the world if I do. It's actually the only one I have left. Rock cabinet. 30. Rock coffer. 30. So, let's get some of them out. Okay, well, let's. Now we're down there, let's go and have a wander, shall we? We've breached the walls. Um, I think my normal dwarves are okay, so which squad are they? They're the tin evenness. Oh, they're all happy. Okay, let's go. So let's move. Uh, A, M. Let's go walk about, see what we can see. We don't need to worry about any forgotten beasts, do we? Yeah, they're not going to move there because I just told them to move onto a. It's a bit, bit more like it.
But yeah, you're gonna get this as you investigate more and more. Right, okay, let's have a quick look at our unit list actually. Chances are we're gonna get close to discovering uh some sort of species down here, some sort of uh men, be them ant men or molten men or something like that anyway. That's all I'm looking for at the moment. Um that's obviously what we've got caged. Um Nope, nothing really. Nothing coming up on the radar. Uh, uh, uh. Nope. Fair enough. Let's have a wonder. Where should we go? Should we go down that way? Oh, go away. Squad A, move. Yeah, can't do a lot about that other than uh, maybe turn the sounds off. <laughs> uh, okay, so that looks like it goes to the edge of the map. So, so why is the edge of the map important? Well, if, for example, you've got a dwarven caravan in your... Or, or, or any... well, it didn't have to be dwarven. Any, any caravan um, in your base and you are being raided uh, or sieged or whatever and uh, your bridge is up. So thi that would give them another exit because all they want to get out of the place is another um, exit on the map. Where's my squad gone? Where, are Where were we? Bollocks, I've lost, lost the plot. Lost the place, lost the plot. Tell you what, let's just tell them to move over here. So, sorry for not talking. I was actually concentrating there. Uh, I, I was just like back in playing mode. I was like, hmm, hmm, what have we got here? Hmm, what? I'm trying to, I'm hoping I can find something like, you know, useful resources. Something. I'm, go I'm assuming there's going to be like spiders and shit down here somewhere. Found anything yet? Have we? Hmm. Okay. Not found anything like astounding or anything. Um. Not really found anything. There's a lot more, lot more mining we can do there. That's that's what we could do. do. Let's uh, move over here. I mean, uh, you don't need to be like. So I'm quite. Fook sick. I'm being fairly reckless um, with it. No, mainly for the fact that I know my dwarves are pretty, pretty damn strong, and now I've lost lost sight of them. Which is not great, I've got to be honest. But I'm I'm assuming that they're uh, they'd be able to deal with anything. Oh, okay. Deal with anything we particularly found that was maybe m 
menacing to them, but uh, to be honest, I think we're pretty much uh, dealing with. Let's go over. Oh, really? You best get the dogs out and assign it to him. Get our souls. Right. Let's move him over here. So, squad A, move. Let's go over that way. I claim this oh! in the name of invention. Well, that's lovely. You draw yourself from society. We're kind of trying to investigate the caverns. So, uh, 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 I was hoping I could find maybe a river or uh, obviously lava would be wonderful, but I think that's out of the question. Squad A, move. This guy's still got in his food anic animal I inaccessible thing going on. Seems like they go quite a long way to go this way. When I'm holding this, I feel unstoppable. Wow. Did you see what I did with this? I'm gonna hang on to this. <laughs> ah, did I tell him to move on one block of stone? Oh, that was a bit silly. Yeah. Here, yeah, boys, where are you? Aha. Uh -huh. They come. So, lots of gold, it would appear. Lots of natural gold in there. Not a great deal of uh, anything else. So, we've got lots of giant spider silk as well, which tells me there's probably giant spiders around here somewhere. I just haven't found them. Um, sneaky little bastards that they are. made some sort of... he's begun his construction. Okay, so I'm going to send my squad back. So they can go back to their... Uh, back to here. So I'm feeling pretty confident we can handle anything that's down there. So we've got um, hunters. Uh, obviously these all these archers, I've got them as uh, hunters. Uh, so chances are... Uh, oh yes, that's a good point, Mike. Maybe who's who's in the uh, who's in here now? Looks like there's a dead cat. Hammer dwarfs. Hmm. No, it is the marks dwarfs. I think these are my marks dwarfs. Yes, they are. I told my marks dwarfs to go in here. I thought, you know what? Let's just see how how overpowered it can be. Yes, it is. It's my marks dwarfs in there. And uh, I'm going to get them all to legendary dodging. So they may survive a little bit longer that way. Because at the moment they've been dying a bit too quick. So, yeah, just like on the, the before with the schedule. Uh, it's plus and minus, by the way, to go through your, your different um, squads here. So the our two uh, archers are the Parity of Ink and the Inky Laws. So you can see exactly the same as, as the Tin Evenness, which is my original squad. Uh, the training 10 minimum. Uh, for two, train for two, then no schedule, train for with defend burrows, and then no schedule. So the no schedule is obviously going in there. They may up the no schedule a little bit because that way they'll go hunting. Because I've also set them on dwarf therapist as hunters. You can do the the stack if you're searching by squad, you just go and they'll do the whole lot as a hunters. Um, I've wiped away all their carrying wow. orders, so they should just go straight out and um, yeah, they should just go straight out and and basically hunt. Uh, and they shouldn't have any any distractions either while they're doing it. So that's the plan. Um, that's how it's going so far. So what's uh, up with... The humble labourers are still really quite pissed off. Um, this guy's really unhappy. Kind of need to fix that. My, my guys in general are, are unhappy. All my normal dwarves are, are, are fucking delirious. They're, they're on the... Ecstatic, 283. Ecstatic, yeah, so, but, uh, I think this guy's finished building a marble crown. 
Oh, a marble crown. That may be worth a bit, but uh, let's have a look. L for artifacts. And there it is. Uh, young Growth's marble crown. It's worth 19,000. It's a piece of shit. <laughs> it's a piece of junk. Um, it's got different pictures of short swords on there and such like. And Blizzard Man on the item is an image of Aspers, the Blizzard Man, and the Sazir. The uh, purge step for the dwarf in the cave, blah, 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 blah. It's basically like got adorned what's happened within the game. The really is quite in depth. I mean, you compare these things to 19,000. That thing was 84,000, um, which was the scepter, I believe, that they made. So I think that's my highest one so far. That's 73,000. 36, but yeah, the, these are the copper swords, etc. Uh, what they've named. But uh, yeah, there's still my scepter's the highest one, 84,000. Not the greatest yet, though. No 100,000 is uh, going wild. So what do we want to do now? Well, we want to actually get in and mine that uh, ore. That's what we want to do. We want to get down there and start mining some of this uh, this goodness that's in here. So how are we going to go about that? Well, we could chop the trees down here as well. Let's, we can chop these trees down. Yeah, why not? So we've got mine. Uh, is this gold there? Don't, it's not, it's not, is it? That's a gem. Gem some sign. So basically, yeah, we just want to start coming in here and uh, getting these gems. So it's more the hunters I kind of want to go around. Did we go down this far? Uh, I just want to double check. There's nothing like crazy down here. Honestly, there's nothing nothing amazing down here that is blowing my skirt right up. So I may bypass it. That sort of thing I want to get. That I want to get there. I dig that shit right out. Oh, yeah. We'll dig that out. We'll have that. See, I don't mind big chunks like that. And shit like that. This this area over here doesn't actually seem too bad. Some big chunks of gold in here, isn't there? Well, how the hell am I going to get to that? That's a, that's a level up. Oh, well, that's okay. Uh, there's also giant spider silk down here, so I'm kind of worried that uh, there might be some giant spiders uh, that will eat my poor little boys as they come down here. Oh well. Oh well. We'll see how it goes. Let's get some of that. Mind some of that shears. Yeah, let's get straight over here. Let's get mining, boys. You know what? Let's go straight up to that. Let's have a big chunk of that out. So we'll see how the miners go. Maybe uh, should I attach war dogs to them? Uh, war dogs aren't going to really do a lot against. Oh, we'll just keep our eyes on them. Some woodcuts coming down there, and we'll keep your eyes on the miner. I've took the Baron off mining, so at least he won't be mining. You could, if you wanted, you could set patrols, etc. But just keep your eye on here. Um, I don't know if there's a way to turn off deceased. I don't want to see deceased on this list. The dead, they're dead. That's great. I just want to see the wild animals. Hey, no, it's all just tame and dwarven babies. Well, nothing's come up yet. I'm sure it will do. Since there's edges, anything could really appear. Um, don't think sieges can come from down below, can they? No, they can't. Um, Got to open up. So here we go. The dwarves are going to start uh, venturing out. So we'll probably start seeing more and more uh, as we go. But every time they're going to mine out this gold, etc., it's going to be get pulled up uh, into our uh, storage. So, uh, onwards and forwards. We're going to continue on in our fort. What can we do now? Can we carry on digging down? Should we carry on digging down? Or should we... Uh, I think we should. I want, kind of want to get my military even stronger. I want even more. Because I want to start digging right down. And bearing in mind we've got no iron. Um, the longevity of the game in deep down is probably going to be quite slow. Quite low. But we're doing alright. I think we're doing okay. We're about 150 dwarfs. We've been holding steady. Uh, yeah, 159 dwarves, holding pretty steady, food supplies, all good, drinks, all good, 
I um, actually changed the drinks, didn't I, so I could get a few more drinks out there. Tons of luxury meals, 1.23 million now we're up to. So overall, things are going pretty well. Uh, there's an officer charge for them, that's what we need to do. We need to get some prisons set up, actually. Uh, yeah, things are going well. We'll just have a dig around our stocks and see if there's anything else I need to change. I can see I've got a load of dimple cups, so I could do a game grinding them. Pigtails as well, loads of those. And tons of rope read as well, so um, while I am thinking about it, it's up here, isn't it? The millstone. That needs to be needs to be powered. Oh, Christ, what's happened here? Huh? Huh? Oh, tits. Ha 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 ha. I didn't think of that one. I wonder if we could dig that out. Let's see if that'll see if that'll solve the problem. <laughs> Didn't think of that. Uh yeah. Well we could do a water wheel now, we've got water around the edge, I suppose. We could uh, move towards that. Hmm. Oops! I didn't think of that, gotta be honest. So what else was I gonna do? I was going to process plants. Oh, dear. I'm yawning, so that's never the best on the microphone. I have been playing this all day, I've got to be honest. And all I've managed to get is sieges on video, despite the fact sort of being hanging around it all day, playing it most of the day. I could have probably streamed it all day. Um, hmm. Should we do our, our sacrificial slaughter? So look at the happiness. Mm, mm. Ah, people have they've they've managed to calm themselves down. The humble oh, laborers. Did you see what I did with this wow. thing? Did you see what I did with this? I'm gonna hang on to this. <laughs> it's an even this. The mountain men. Should we should we test the mountain men? See how good they are these days. We are the mountain men. It's not the mountain men in there, is it? Who, who's having their current stint? I think these are my archers. Oh no, they're hammer dwarfs. Uh, uh, uh. Who's in there now? I don't know what month we're in. Sibrek is in there at the moment. And Sibrek is in. If only their names had have stayed, that would have been nice. Sibrek is in the Parity of Ink. So they are my hunters. Um, in fact, I'm going to have a quick read and see if there are. Let's have a look at their military status now. Uh, the parity of ink. Oh, here we go. They've become... What? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> huh. Hmm. So the parity of ink, which are my hunters, which I can assure you are my hunters, were my hunters, have leather, have become hammer dwarfs. <laughs> oh, okay. That's that's interesting. So they've, despite the fact that I've got them all on hunting, uh, they're down as archers. They're training as archers. They are, well, they are legendary fighters, uh, legendary shield users, and because I guess the silver warhammers were available and the crossbows maybe not. I'm pretty sure they've all got crossbows. They're all saying they've got individual ranged and choice ranged. Let's have a look at their items. Uh, inventory. Uh, trousers, trousers. Robe, robe. Cloak, cap. Cap, hood. Left glove, right glove, left glove, right glove, left glove, right glove. How many mittens do you need, seriously? Uh, sandal, sandal, trousers. Iron shield. Bronze crossbow. Well, that's interesting. So how have they... They don't have quivers, do they? That may be it. That may be it. Supplies. Have we made the classic mistake? No. I don't know what CNT means. Oh, combat and uh, training, isn't it? Yes. No, they're all armed up. Is that all that I was going to say? Is that all the bolts I've got left? 
Hmm. Answers on a postcard. I didn't see any quiver. I've got to be honest on the on said person. So let's see if we can find a quiver on here. No. Oh, he has. He's got a giant toad quiver. Quiver. He doesn't. So nine crossbow and a quiver. Oh, then we've got the quivers. There's nothing on there. And yet, they are training as hammer dwarves. Is that because of the other guys? And when I say training, I mean that they're already up to like great hammer dwarf level 11. So, I don't know. Gotta be honest, I just don't know. Oh well, nevertheless, we'll carry on. Carry on! Jolly good show. Let's have a look. Read the dwarves. Who's happy and who's unhappy of the squads? Uh, the tint evenness are bloody delirious, to be honest, so I'm going to move them up. They're loving their job. And they're, and they're the boys that are on guard down here. I'm feeling that they can probably come up. They're going to have traps there. They should be alright, these guys. No, no, no. I don't want to move them away, got to be honest. Um, how about Squad B? How are you boys doing? Squad B is... Is it the mountainous men? Or no, 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 they're still... Humble labourers are a bit pissed off. The mountainous men are happy. Okay, Squad B. It is. Up you come. And uh, we'll have... Um, a few of Squad B. We'll have Iron J. Is that a hammer dwarf? They're both hammer dwarves. Yeah, one of you and you. Um, you can come up here. Just in case. So what are we going to do? We're going to dump them all down the pit. I'm not going to remove anything. I'm just going to throw them in there. Once everyone's in place, which they are. They've randomly run off to change their outfits. Yeah, they like to look the best when they're dumping people down the pit. So, let's go for it. Let's see how quick these guys can handle it. Oh, shit. Actually, mm, no. There's a bloody good reason I can't dump them. There's a bloody good reason that I have the sword squad up there, isn't there? Ooh, dear, 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 dear. I don't think I have any swords masters. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. B... You're gonna have to go. No, there's a back to back to the drawing boards, boys. Uh, it's A that needs to come up. We really do need those swords dwarves trained up a bit better, don't we? So they come up here. I love how they get that little jingle because they're off duty. I and J, you come here. <laughs> As I hiccup, they'll move up there. So I'll split those two guys out. Uh, da -dum -da -dum -da -dum. Sorry, I can't do it, sir. And they should be down there. Yes, they are. P and down you go, boys. Stump a load of those. So they only kind of take them one at a time, although I think they're going to take quite a few at a time, this one. See, that one didn't want to go. That one didn't want to go, so they're having to get on him. Wakey, wakey, boys. These guys are trying to get out. I didn't, uh, I didn't go too well, did it? Are you going to react, mate? What are you doing? You there. What's up with him? I don't know. Oh well, they went down eventually. Not quite as quickly as I'd hoped. Okay, he's back. Let's throw some more down. 
Probably went a bit too quick, maybe. Chuck him in, lads. Chuck him in. Oh my god, the Baron's coming to do it. Okay, the Baron just chucked someone down there. Acid, you are just taking liberties of your position. Oh, he's actually leashing them all the way back. Look, he's bringing them out and he's just gone into the rock trap. <laughs> he's like, you will get down that pit. <laughs> Dragging him out still. No, really, you're going in that pit. Boom, down you went. <laughs> so, continuing on. Let's get the next load down there. Let's take a bunch of goblins this time. We'll go four. Obviously the hammer dwarves can get involved in that. Oh, they're getting two at a time. Oh, I think my Baron just got shot there. I think the Baron actually took one in the face. Let's have a look at his uh, wounds. No, he was okay. Definitely blood came out, didn't it? Maybe he's just feeling, feeling hardcore. Boom, 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 boom. Keep them going. So this is... I, I thought I'd show you this. Right? I, mean, I think I probably showed you it already. Um, this is just how I get rid of them all after a battle. While it's all calmed down a little bit. It's giving the dwarves kills as well. Uh, as well as keeping them trained, etc. They're getting uh, notoriety from doing this. I think one just tried to get away there, didn't it? Didn't happen though. Didn't work out too well for him. Human diplomat arrived. Don't mind us, we're just dumping. So, the, what you could do here, really, instead of this, if you didn't want them to fight it, you could just make this about, I think about seven Z levels deep and start dropping them down there. I think it will pretty much kill most of them. I don't, I think it's like six, maybe, Z levels. I saw someone could post it the exact amount. I'm sure it's like six or seven, and it will pretty much do them. I think if you do like four or five, it will pretty much break the legs when they land. Uh, s yeah, I mean, uh, experiment with it, really. Um, or you can make some sort of elaborate traps that they can run around, like a mouse trap type styly thing. Um, dump them down into that. These are all spear dwarves, so I don't think there's any thieves, so I don't think there's really any worry of them getting away here. Just chucking them down that trap. Chuck them down the well. This guy's brave, he's bringing his baby on with him. Of course, all this time I'm I'm not taking any note of what's happening down here. I think I assume they're all okay. We've been digging out stone down here, haven't we? So we've not heard anything from it. <sighs> I'm feeling unstoppable at the moment. I have to be honest. I'm sure we'll get something that will come and tear us a new one. It's it'll be that time when you just like go in a bit overconfident and you suddenly lose your dwarves and you're like oh, I've got nothing else that's what it'll be, oh that was an elite guy oh, he didn't last long did he <laughs> they're jumping on him who's gonna get the kill shot, it's like it's like an FPS going on here He's, who can get the kill score that was a legendary child I just saw there I don't know what he's been doing, but there was definitely a child that was legendary. Um, I don't think I've got anything else I can drop down here. Sorry, boys. We are all goblined out. Yep. It's come for discussions. Uh, 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 uh. There we go. Send them back, to the back about their way. And job done. Well done, lads. I don't think I need to claim it, but we'll do it anyway. So they'll pick everything up. And ironically, they're also cleaning it. 
they, they, they're, they're bringing soap down and they're cleaning uh, the blood off the floor. Uh, yeah, bless him. So what's that guy doing there? I think he might have been cleaning then. It's a beautiful, beautiful fortress coming along. We can engrave this. Maybe. Start engraving the rooms. Right. I actually I could do with talking about that. So the economy is broken. Okay? If the economy goes back in, don't do this. <laughs> what I'm doing here, don't do it. Because uh it means your when the economy was, was running, uh your dwarves had to pay taxes on their room, etc. And these rooms would be far too good, basically. That's that'd be the issue. That's how I'm going to make my dwarves be happy. I'm going to make them go back to the room. Let's do that now. Uh, instead of sleeping in the barracks at will, I'm going to make them go to the room at will. I think that might make them a bit happier. I mean, they're on sleeping room at will at there anyway. I don't know. Sleeping room. Sleep it room at well, barracks at well, room at well, room at well, room at well, room at well. Actually, no, 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 no. These need to be the barracks, don't they? Yeah, no. These do need to be the barracks. Okay. Yeah. Uh, ignore that. <laughs> Uh, these are the guys that are down in the bottom, aren't they? It's not these ones that are pissed off. I I think them guys are only pissed off because that baby died. I mean, just one little baby. That's all it was. I don't know what the importance was. Uh, it's obviously one of the babies. They were carrying a baby. Yeah, okay. We won't worry about that. So, let's, let's move on to something more important. Say, a caravan turning up. Right, if this caravan's turned up, it almost certainly means there's going to be something to follow, probably. Like an ambush or a siege. This is generally how it's happening. Um, or a fox coming in there. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to deal with that caravan. It looks like an elven caravan, isn't it? Yeah, it's nothing exciting, I don't think. Uh, and continue on our way. And I'm going to start... I may even dig it down a bit deeper now, because I'm not overly thrilled with what I found in there. I think it probably was the first caravan layer, so we could do it going down uh, to a slightly better... Uh, cavern layer to uh, perhaps I uh, oh, kind of want darker silver for there. Um, yeah, I'm not sure. We'll see. We're getting to the point where we want to start doing some sort of fancy stuff, um, and I'm not too sure where to start. I could do with having to think about it. I've probably been playing too much today, and I need to sort of step back and have a think about what I'm doing. So maybe it'll also give the uh, the VOD's time to encode, and this looks like it's been running for quite a while because, the, yeah, the video's looking like it's been quite long. So, this is D-Man bringing you the, what are we up to, 18th episode of Let's Play Dwarf Fortress. We'll be back with something, something fancy with the next one, maybe. Maybe some sort of pump system or something, I don't know, something crazy. Let's 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 think of something up. Um, if you could think of anything, please feel free to leave your comments in the uh, YouTube videos or I don't know, any of the forums I'm on. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel, there'll be many more to come. Thanks for listening guys, I'll be back soon.